I want you to think about the first job interview that you ever had. Your parents probably told you to look presentable and how to create your resume. You may have even practiced answering interview questions in the mirror before the big day. As teenagers, they teach us that these things will help you get the job. In reality, it's actually none of those things. Welcome to Branding Bites. I am Claire Bond, personal brand strategist and the CEO and co-founder of Claire Bond Group. And I've been helping people strategize and create their best personal brands for over 10 years. And I want to help you leverage your personal brand to develop the authority, influence, and trust you need to exceed your business goals. So before we get started, please subscribe or follow as it really helps me keep this video series going and I appreciate it. <laughs> so in this video, I'm going to be talking about how your personal brand can future-proof your career. Your personal brand is what lands you the job. Your resume and your work wardrobe probably play some factor in how people perceive you, but it's the way you present yourself in the interview that ultimately gets you that new paycheck. But here's the thing. Nowadays, your career depends heavily on what you post online as well. So when I graduated from college, I didn't have to worry about social media presence to land my first job at my first fortune, at my first fortune 500 company. But you better believe that if I were trying to get that same job today, I would be blasting my expertise all over social media. So why is it that social media is such a big part of future-proofing your career? It's not so much about social media as it is about your personal brand. Your brand is what people find out about you when they Google you. The less they find, the less likely they are to hire you or much less even bring you in for an interview or invest in your company. Entrepreneurs make the same mistake. They think the key to getting more business is going viral on social media. Can't even tell you how many times I've heard that. But when you depend on some obscure factor like going viral, AKA you get lucky to build your business or to get that job, you're risking the likely outcome of not being successful at all. If you want to future proof your career, you need to take into account what actually matters and take it into your own hands. So here are three ways that you can do that. Number one, focus on your personal brand. Let people get to know you, but I would advise staying out of any online drama, you know, eh, steer clear of that, but get out there and start building that brand. Number two, provide valuable and free content so that your future employer or your ideal client can see you for the expert that you are. You can use social media, but SEO blogging can actually help to establish your brand authority a lot faster than a few TikTok videos. I know TikTok videos are super fun to do, but sometimes good old fashioned Google and blogging still wins. All right, number three, show up and stand out. Consistency is really everything when it comes to building your personal brand and your career. If you don't show up for work, you get fired, right? So you need to treat your online presence the same way because you're being judged on it. The more you show up, the more likely you are to stand out and the more likely you are to get that corporate job or that, that ideal client that you're looking for. So be consistent. And if you want my full guide on how to future-proof your career by building your personal brand, just click the link in the description box to go directly to that blog. And please make sure to comment or like as it really helps me keep this video series going, and I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.